Hi, I'm George and I am an actor. I also happen to have Down syndrome. I love watching films, especially the Oscars. This year's Oscars have been more diverse with their nominations, including Sound of Metal, Crip Camp and Feeling Through. Today, I'm going to explore what it means to people with disability. Do you know that out of all the nominations this year, only three films depict people with a disability? In the past, we've, we've seen great people coming through. As an example, Zach Gottsman in the appearance for Butter Falcon. Should we just be grateful our community is in the Oscars this year? No, I certainly don't think that we should be grateful that we've been included because it's not equal. And until it's equal, it's not inclusive. I think it's a massive positive step forward. However, it's almost like taking one step forward and 10 steps back. We know the actors portraying disabled people's stories and lives haven't had that lived experience themselves. So yes, it's great we're getting the representation, but it's still not authentic. I am happy that these three films are in the Oscar this year. But I just really feel there could be more. People like me do exist and there is talent in all actors. The big question right now is should non-disabled actors be portraying characters with a disability? Is it just acting or should it be decided on a case by case basis? If we lived in a world where I saw disabled actors playing non-disabled characters, then my answer would be perhaps we should look at that on a case-by-case -case basis. But we don't, so my answer is no, because there's a glaring double standard in the film and media industry where it seems to be okay that non-disabled actors can play disabled characters, but never the other way around. So I do think it should be taken on a case-by-case -case basis because disability is so individual, but also whatever happens, someone with that disability, a representative of the disabled community, needs to be in the room when decisions are being made because otherwise it's just not right. New rules surrounding the Oscars date that from 2024, films should meet diversity quotas to have a chance at winning. Will the new rules help improve the representation of people with a disability? I do think that there is some merit in introducing quotas because it will force films into including diverse roles and diverse talent on screen and off and I just hope that that diversity includes disability in that conversation. However, I don't think it's going to be the solution until everybody recognises the responsibility that they have when they're putting together scripts and casts and stories and films, if people don't understand that their obligation is to represent the societies that we live in, then sadly this will just be another scheme that fails. It depends on how exciting the roles are. If the parts aren't very exciting or engaging, then it won't make a difference. It's got to be meaningful. So, there's been some progress at this Oscars. Says hope for next year will be bigger and better.